Hi, I'm Barbara and welcome back to our stock trading app, part three. Andy and I are going to show you how to implement second factor authentication using one-time password. As you recall, our stock trading app requires second factor authentication using one-time password when trading shares are over 10,000. To implement one-time password, we override the on OTP authenticate request in the mass authentication listener interface. When one time password is requested, the SDK will trigger the on OTP authenticate request callback. We can see the mass OTP authentication handler is provided for the on OTP authenticate request callback. To select the channel to deliver the one time password, we use Mass OTP Authentication Handler doc deliver. The channel can be email or SMS. After we get the one time password from the specified channel, we invoke Mass OTP Authentication Handler dot proceed with the one time password. To simplify and speed up development, the Mass UI module provides a sample one-time password user interface. This user interface allows the user to select the OTP delivery channel and provides the one-time password that accesses the API. To prompt the user for the OTP, use the Mass UI OTP fragment. Just instantiate Mass OTP select delivery channel fragment and show it when one time password is triggered. Now let's run the app and test the interaction. So I'll start by providing the trade parameters by entering 20,000 for the shares and click buy. Since the API is defined to have one time password for over 10,000 shares, the on OTP authenticate request is triggered and we can see a dialog asking for the channel to deliver the one time password. In this example, I will use email as my delivery channel and click send OTP. Let's go and check my email. Ah, I've got an email with one time password. So I provide this password for my API call and click verify. Now I can successfully access the API with one time password. To summarize our sample stock trading app, the mobile SDK provides high level interfaces to access APIs. The communication between the device and the gateway is secure. Accessing APIs is easy to implement and requires less coding because you don't have to handle the underlying security, networking, and OAuth protocol. Implementing geolocation and one-time password can protect your APIs and are easy to implement. Thanks for watching and see you next time.